Hello and welcome to Troy Giles and the Hartman Business Machines YouTube channel. For this video, I am going to explain how you can import a pre-saved preset to help with printing special print jobs. For this example, it is based on a letterhead being in tray two um, with the tray two paper type set at the printer as letterhead okay so again you've got a two tray printer in this example and it's going to be letterhead in tray two with the paper type set to letterhead at the machine so here we are let's just pretend this is your document that you need to print to letterhead okay for the one and only time that you need to get the correct letterhead setting in to your print driver this is what you will do so you're going to go to file and print okay you're going to pull up in this example we're working with a sp5300 so make sure that that is the printer you're going to be using and then go to printer properties okay once you have opened up that driver you may already have a preset called letterhead in it for this example specifically for henry swinton uh, you're gonna delete that already set icon unless you're not having trouble if you're not having trouble don't worry about it but we're gonna go into the manage area okay here is a list of your presets so you could already have letterhead on it if so highlight it and then press delete okay um, if you don't have any or you already have deleted it this is what you will now do you're gonna go to import Click import. You're going to be browsing for the letterhead preset setting. Mine just happens to come back up straight away because I've already saved it somewhere and already recorded it. However, for this example for Henry Swinton, you're going to be on the shared data server, file area, whatever you want to call it, and it'll be at the bottom of that shared data file. Okay, once you see it, double click it. Bang. It's there. Press OK. And then for this example, let's just go cancel because now you're back at this document. You want to print, printer properties. You will now have letterhead. Bang. As soon as you check that, it'll have the correct settings. Then you'll press OK and print. I hope this helps. Thank you.